Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Democracy 3. This is Obda Potato. We are having a little bit of a problem here. Um, our expenditure is a lot higher than our income. And that is something that needs to change very, very soon indeed. Expenditure, state health service is a, is a major thing at the moment. Let's try and reduce that, perhaps. Next turn. Yeah, we've got a lot of stuff to do. Organized crime is starting to decrease. Not quite. Armed police. Can't increase that anymore because we've only got eight political capital. Don't really have that much. We can't really do that much with anything. So let's go ahead to the next turn. Okay, failed assassination attempt. That's worrying. That is worrying. Credit rating upgraded. That's what we like to see. We're running a budget deficit. We are in serious... We're serious, serious, seriously bad place. Okay. We need to decrease our threat assessment as well. Because that is not good. That is not good at all. Telecommuting initiative decreases car usage. That's, that's nice. That's nice. Okay. What can we get rid of? Income tax. That's bringing in basically all of our income. If we, if we jump off this cliff, then there's going to have to be a lot of stuff. You know, there's going to have to, we're going to have to cut a lot of stuff. State health service. It helps health. That's that's what matters. Middle income. What do they care about? They they really care about income tax. What are the property tax? We could conceivably cancel this if we had enough political capital. We could cancel this and this would make everybody happy, including the middle income people, which is the people we need to attract for this election. Quite a lot of environmentalists as well. Hmm. Well, what is this? Decreases CO2 emissions. Microgeneration. Yeah, let's do this. Why not? Make the uh, environmentalists a little bit more happy with us. Religious people don't hate us so much. Legalizing prostitution. It does help GDP a little bit. Wow, okay. This is, uh... That's that's pretty controversial. Okay, so Can Canada, Canada is clearly a bit of a religious place. Or at least in this game it is, anyway. But, you know, I say it, but we're not actually doing too badly. We're not doing too badly at all. Foreign aid. Do capitalists like foreign aid? No. Foreign relations. How are, how are our foreign relations? Hmm... Interesting. We were going to cancel the, uh, the tobacco tax, weren't we? No, no, it wasn't the tobacco tax that we were going to cancel. It was the property tax that we were going to cancel. Yeah, with 33 political capital needed. Okay, let's go in here. Okay, maximum's 38, so we have... Let's, let's work this out. Current capital available, 19. 19 plus 24 is... Yes, yeah, so we still have another 5 political capital to spend. Which means... Yes, it is 5, isn't it? No, it's 4. It's 4 political capital that we can spend on implementing a policy. Hmm. What policy that should be is interesting. Because there's a lot of things we could do. How much is this going to cost to introduce? Seven. Yeah, let's go for it, you know. People are pretty happy with that. And let's bump it up all the way. Self-employed people. It's going to upset the socialists. But high earnings. Yeah, we're going to go for it. Let's end the turn there so we can still cancel this property tax next turn. Socialist plot. Okay. Technological advantage. That's good. 
that's really good. I I am very happy with, with where we're where we're at at the moment. General strike, poor earnings. We shouldn't be having poor earnings. Wages are at an all-time low because of labor laws and immigration. Hmm. Public smoking ban, leave law unchanged. Budget deficit of 15 million. Recession, yeah, GDP is going up and down. It's about to get even worse once we can't cancel this property tax. Um, yeah, that's what we're cancelling. Hopefully that's going to make everybody just a little bit happier with us. Obviously the socialists are, you know, our major sort of thorn at the moment. Let's increase this next turn. We can raise this next turn to set costing seven political capital and that shouldn't be uh, shouldn't be too much of a problem. Can we get rid of can we get rid of this yet? No, it's going to cost 24 political capital to cancel. Hopefully we don't die. I mean, I'm presuming we're probably pretty close to dying. Failed assassination attempt. I thought so. Race riots. God. Why is why is racial tension so high? Uncontrolled immigration. Goodness sake. Perhaps if we just perhaps if we just banned religion, then that wouldn't be so much of a problem. Everyone likes us a little bit more. We're still in a recession. Our interest rate skyrocketed. We're not in a good place. But people are starting to like us a little bit more. We need to get the socialists back on our side, unfortunately. Equality. Tax shelters. Okay, tax shelters. Nobody seems to really like tax shelters. Hmm. Nobody likes tax... Why, do, why don't conservatives like us? Because of race riots, strikes prostitution, race discrimination act, what is this? Decreases racial tension. Conservatives don't like it. We're gonna raise this. We're gonna raise this right up to the top. Why not? That that seems like a good thing to take a little chunk out of racial tension. Alcohol tax, can we decrease this? Or increase this should I say? Poor people don't like it, and it increases poverty. We're not going to do it. We're not going to do it at all. So, clearly, maintaining a system with, with you know, such little tax is, is difficult. I mean, we can't even get rid of our, you know, health care. We need to clearly cut our spending, but, you know, that's difficult. Let's work on it. Let's work on our on decreasing our spending. So, military spending, state schools, and state health care are all going to take a hit in the next few turns. Another failed assassination attempt. This is worrying. This is worrying. 19% of the vote. How many turns is the election away? Four turns away. We're four turns away from an election. What do socialists want? Tax shelters. They want tax shelters to be repealed. Okay, so we're at a maximum. Let's scale it back. Can we scale it back? Yeah. Let's scale it back all the way. Socialists will hate us a little bit less, hopefully. Um, now, how can we decrease the size of our state healthcare service? Possibly? No, we don't have the political capital to do that quite yet. What else? Income tax. Income tax is where we're getting basically most of our money. Let's decrease it a little bit. We can't really afford to. We really, you know, we're we're. Our, spend our expenditure is too high. Way, way too high. GDP needs to pick up massively. 
debt interest is now a serious problem. We should never let that get out of control. Never. State schools. Okay. Next turn, we're gonna we're gonna cut a lot. But we also need to introduce another failed assassination attempt. Credit rating upgraded, that's good. We're sort of in recession, but we're sort of picking up. That's what we like to see. Socialists like us a little bit more. Can we uh, can we have a look at our threat assessments? I don't know how to do that, but uh, yeah, here it is. The Revolutionary Army. They don't like us. They really don't like us. Hmm. There's not much we can do about that at the moment, actually. How can we... There is... There is no way to sort of help. There's no way to sort of better our chances. Yeah, we we could do that, but at the same time, at the same time, it's vital that we you know get our get our expenditure down. Is there anything? Is there any tax policies that we can introduce? Airline tax. Hmm. Graduate tax. Hybrid car initiative. Nah, nobody wants, nobody wants, uh, and rightfully so, junk food taxes or stuff like that. Nobody wants that. What about carbon tax? No, nobody wants a carbon tax. Surprise, surprise. Tax on superstores. Could bring us in a little bit of money, but not nearly enough. Hmm. I think we do bump this up a little bit. That'll help. Socialists like us a little bit more. Did we bump up legal aid? No, we didn't. We will. It's not going to cost us. It's effectively going to cost us nothing. And it's better relations. State schools and state health care. Both are far too important to start cutting at the moment. We're in a really difficult situation. A really really difficult situation when it comes to sort of dealing with the socialist threat against our lives like that's a real issue <clears throat> and you know we're three turns away from the election and people still hate us it's fully fun this yeah Yeah, let's do that. People still don't like us, and they need to be liking us, because otherwise we're not going to get re-elected. Food stamps. Yeah. It could work. Socialists would like that, actually. It would make farmers happy. It would decrease poverty. Poor would like us. Poor earnings would like us. Increase health. Everybody is happy with this. Everybody is happy. That's really good. Apart from the fact, you know, it, it does cost us money. But, but that's it. Hopefully we don't die. Please don't die. We died. Uh, today the evil capitalist lapdog in charge of this country, that was you, was heroically assassinated by a crack team of comrades from the Revolutionary Army. Our brave soldiers attacked the very heart of the capitalist machine by opening fire in the middle of a speech to the banking community. A number of evil fascists were killed as well as the so-called president of our country. Well, Prime Minister, if you want to be correct. Sadly, all the comrades involved in this heroic battle have been killed by government forces. This is a victory for the common man and game over for you. That's unfortunate, but I think we did all right. Uh, if you'd like to see, you know, something similar, then you know, leave me a comment in the in the comments down below. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.